Chapter 1. Well Testing Introduction. Well Testing History. Fossil fuels have been used by man for generations. The Industrial Revolution created a large demand for fuel to supply the emerging industries and the corresponding social changes. Initially oil was mainly obtained through whaling and other animal fats, however the availability of surface oil deposits was creating specific excitement among the scientific community. The first commercial oil well was drilled near Oil Creek, Pennsylvania, by Colonel Edwin L. Drake in 1859 which marked the birth of the modern petroleum industry. Well testing techniques were first applied in the early 1920s. A simple pressure measurement was taken using a Borden tube and stylus arrangement. Early analysis techniques were presented by Muscat in the 1930s and later in the 1950s with the classical work of Miller, Dyes, Hutchinson and Horner. Electronic recording devices in the early 1970s and computerized systems in the early 1980s set new standards of data acquisition and interpretation techniques. Well Testing Overview when drilling a well, the client has a number of questions to answer. What is the size of my reservoir? How much will it produce? What fluids are going to be produced? The aim of well testing is to answer these questions by the identification of produced fluids, the determination of reservoir deliverability, and, later on, the well test data collected will be used to predict the reservoir size. Well testing determines production capabilities and reservoir properties. Well testing is the only technique that examines a significant portion of the reservoir under dynamic conditions. Accurate, long-term projections about a reservoir cannot be made based on wireline and other static techniques. Tests on oil or gas wells are performed at various stages of drilling, after open hole logging, completion and production, and for different purposes. The data acquired when a reservoir is tested includes The flow rates of oil, gas, water and solids produced The pressure and temperature recorded at surface and at bottom hole The PDT samples of representative reservoir fluids collected at surface and at bottom hole What is well testing? Well testing is the only technique examining a significant portion of the reservoir under dynamic conditions to determine its production capabilities and reservoir properties. Tests on oil or gas wells are performed for different purposes at various stages of drilling, completion, or production. It is important to fully understand the reason for each of these tests and what is expected to be accomplished with the results. It generally consists of identifying, measuring, and sampling and finally disposing of the well effluent produced during these operations that involve flowing the test zones from just a few hours to a few days. The flowing period normally precedes the shut-in of the well. Pressure buildup data analysis provides invaluable information about the producibility of the well and the extent of the reservoir that is being drained. Aim of Well Testing the aim of the well testing is the identification of the produced fluids and the determination of the reservoir deliverability. Well test results may have far-reaching effects on future field development planning. Therefore, it is most important that objectives are clearly defined and the well test programs are designed accordingly. Most well tests can be classified as productivity tests, which is a simple identification of produced fluids and determination of reservoir deliverability or descriptive reservoir tests which consist of definition of complex reservoir features. Sequences of well testing In order to produce oil at surface, the first step consists of perforating the reservoir using tubing conveyed perforations, TCP. The next step consists of using the DST drill stem test equipment to convey the flow to surface. The main DST equipment includes the packer, the tester valve, the tubing or drill pipes and, eventually, the subsurface safety valve. Finally, the surface well testing equipment are used to handle the flow at surface. It includes the flow head, the choke manifold, the burners and others more. This picture shows the complete setup of a well testing package from bottom hole to surface. Well testing measurements 
The required measurements from well testing are the rates of each fluids produced, the bottom hole conditions behavior, and the PVT study of representative reservoir samples. The purpose of a DST or production test. 1. Determine the nature of fluids produced. PVT analysis are performed at bottom hole conditions or from surface recombined samples. 2. Define the well productivity. Productivity index and IPR plot for oil wells, or deliverability curve and absolute open flow, AOF, for gas wells. 3. Evaluate the characteristics of the producing formation. Determine static pressure, PI, and formation flow capacity, KH, for reservoir heterogeneity and limits. 4. Evaluate any formation damage, skin factor, S. Determine if acidizing or other treatment is required and control the results of the stimulation or treatment. Thank you for your attention. This is the end of today's presentation. In the next video presentation, Chapter 2, you will learn about the DST drill stem testing tools. Please hit like and subscribe to our channel in order to help us produce more content like this one.